Hi, this is Paige here for another tutorial Tuesday. Today we will be doing a paper wall quilt to decorate a blank wall in your office or home. For our craft day, you will need paper of your choice. I use some scrapbooking paper. This template of a rhombus that you can make in any word processor. Some double-sided tape, an X-Acto knife, a pair of scissors, and a cutting surface. I'm using a cardboard. Uh, cut out from a box. You can use whatever you want. To start this craft, you're going to take your paper of choice and we're going to start cutting out shapes. You can use either your scissors or your X-Acto knife to cut out the shape. The X-Acto knife will give you a more precise edge. There's our first shape. After you're done cutting out all your shapes, you're going to start arranging them how you would like to see on the wall. So I'm just going to start and just leave, I like to leave a little gap here between the shapes. You can choose to put them together if you'd like. And really have fun with it. Mix up your patterns, see what patterns look nice next to one another, along with some solid colors. Really have fun and be adventurous with what you like to put on the wall. Once you have your design all laid out, you'll take some double-sided tape and you can start placing it on the wall. Thank you for joining us for another Tutorial Tuesday. Please share with us your paper wall quilt and other creations. See you next time!